Well, CTV fans, here we are in wonderful Northern Arizona University. The sun has disappeared. The snow has come down on us in the blizzard. I've got no pants and I'm freezing. Didn't even pack any. Silly. Anyway, we'll go see what some NAU students have got to say about this thing, football. Let's go see what they got to say. Molly Kitts, Sharad, how are you? Nice to meet you. Oh, your hands are nice and warm. You mean in your pockets. Okay. Was it Michelle? Yep. I'm Sharad, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good, it's very cold out here. I should, probably should have worn some long pants, don't you uh, reckon? Yes. <laughs> <You're> crazy. <laughs> Scotty, Scotty, Scotty too hotty. Scotty, naughty. All right, Scotty, hold that for me. All right, Molly. Molly, Molly, kiss a dolly. Can I please get you to hold that? Do you have any idea what that is or what it's used for? I know it's uh, football. Rugby. Ball. It's a rugby ball. Close. Is it a rugby ball? It's not a rugby ball. Is it Australian rules football, maybe? It is Australian rules football. Yes. Well done. Thank you, thank you. You're probably the first one to get a correct answer. Nice. Do you know why? Because he's an athlete. Look at him. Exactly. Strapping young man. <laughs> Absolutely. I played a little football back in my day, so it's very similar. A little bit bigger, but never really held one of these before, so... Do you like the feel of it? Yeah, it's nice. It's... Ever heard of Australian rules football? Uh, yeah, hold on. Let me, let me see if I can switch up my accent. Uh, I have a friend from Bristol, England. Yes, brother. Yes, I've definitely heard of English football. <laughs> no, <laughs> not English, Australia football, eh? Yeah, Australia, the other English down under. We like to kick the ones <laughs> all the way. No, no, we're the other way. We're okay. down under. Kangaroo brand, Sharon. So that's a, that's an Australian rules football. Have you ever heard of Australian rules football? No, have not. Have you ever heard of Australian rules football? Yeah, I've watched it before. You've watched it before. Which team have you watched? I watched. I don't know. It was the Super Bowl type thing. A couple months ago. Yeah, it was the grand final. That's that's we played in the we played in the grand final. You did? Yeah. So we we won it in 2010, but then we weren't quite close rematch, enough last right? year. The rematch. The rematch. Yeah. See? Scotty knows what we're talking about. A little bit. It's not a rugby ball. Is it a football? It's a football. That's what we call it. It's a football. We play a game called Australian Rules Football. Have you ever heard of it? No, I have not. Have you seen the big group of young strapping men rolling around the campus last week or so? Unfortunately, I haven't seen a bunch of young men. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, she reckons. <laughs> yeah, maybe you just haven't seen any strapping ones. <laughs> Wait, I've got to check my questions. <clears throat> we can cut this out later. <laughs> okay. Uh, here we got the boys just rolling up behind. We better make sure they don't do anything silly. <laughs> can you, off the top of your head, name me one famous Australian? Oh, boy. Um... I don't know, you got me on the spot here. Um, Steve Irwin, that's it. Steve Irwin, that's a pretty good one. You know he's got a day named after him in Australia, Steve Irwin Day. Oh, that's awesome. He just <laughs> Crocodile Dundee. <laughs> Crocodile Dundee, Paul Hogan. Is, is Paul Hogan, he's, a, he's yeah, an Australian, right? Yeah, he's an Australian. It, just to show, that's that's how us Americans here in America, that's about the only Australian we know, yeah. is Crocodile Dundee. No. None. None. What about the guy who threw a phone at the bell boy? I don't know what you're talking about. Russell Crowe. Okay, Russell Crowe. Um, the alligator man. <laughs> the guy with the alligator. An Australian? Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin. Another Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin must be massive over here. Do you know who Sharad Wellingham is? Never heard of him. Have you heard of Sharad Wellingham? I have it. I'm Sharad Wellingham. Oh. Can you give me your best Australian accent? You've heard me talk for a little while now. Oh my gosh, no. Can I you? so bad can, in accents. Can you give me a good day, mate? G'day, mate. It was all right. G'day, mate. <laughs> Chuck another shrimp on the barbie. Chuck. <laughs> okay. Chuck another shrimp on the barbie. <laughs> all right. Can you done it right there, Darren? G'day, mate. Oh, oh boy. Oh. I was like, good day, mate. Oh, <laughs> good day, mate. Good day, mate. Come on, Molly. Good day, mate. <laughs> can I get a chuck a shrimp on the barbie? Shrimp on the barbie. Chuck it. You got to say chuck a shrimp on the barbie. Chuck a shrimp on the barbie. Well done, Molly. <laughs> well, there you have it. They had no idea about anything to do with Australian rules football, bar probably one. We heard what they had to say. I'm cold. I'm going to go sit in the spa, warm up, get back to the hotel. Enjoy. I'll give you an example here. If you stand there, we, we kick it like this, and you stick your hands up and try and catch it. We kick it to each other. That's why we call it football. <laughs> we don't we don't throw it or anything like that. Do that Not like those. Yeah, that's right. We do that one. Give us 
handball it, handball it to me, right? Do that. <laughs> Good effort. <laughs>